How many times a day do you use water? All you have to do is turn a handle or press a button and safe clean water appears. But in many places in the world, clean water is not as easy to access. Millions of people, mostly women and children, walk dozens of miles every day to collect water for their families. The water they collect is dirty and can cause them to get sick from drinking it. In order to kill germs in the water, women will build fires to boil it. However, that means walking more miles to collect firewood or using money to buy charcoal. To make matters worse, inhaling the smoke from these fires can lead to respiratory diseases. All this time, money and effort is expended daily in order to meet such a basic human need. It keeps children from attending school and women from working to earn an income. Without education and without work, these families continue to live in poverty. How will you solve this problem? Swedish inventor Petra Wattström set out to find a simple solution to the complex problem of providing people with access to clean water. She knew that exposing water to solar radiation from the sun can destroy the harmful germs that makes water unsafe. After years of innovating and prototyping different solutions, Petra created Solvatin, a case that UV disinfects water. And clean water is poured through a fabric filter that catches large contaminants. Then, the case unfolds like a book, ready to catch the sun's purifying rays. After a few hours, a green smiley face indicator lets you know the water is safe to use. Ready for cooking, bathing, cleaning and drinking. With Solvatin, people can collect water from sources closer to their homes that they previously avoided because of how dirty they were, giving them more time to work and earn an income or go to school. Solvatin is simple, effective and built to last. Josephine and her children live in rural Kenya. Josephine doesn't have running water in her home. So twice a day, she works 30 minutes to collect water from a dirty river. She fills her jerry can and carries it home. Before she can give the water to her children, she collects firewood from trees an hour away so she can build a small fire to boil the water and kill the germs. Even still, her children often get sick with life-threatening waterborne diseases, which require expensive and frequent treatment. But that all changed when she started using Solvatin. She now pours the water she's collected from the river into the Solvatin, leaves it in the sun for several hours, and the harmful germs are killed. Her kids are no longer getting sick, and she can save the money she's been spending on doctor visits to pay for her children's school fees and improve their nutrition. Josephine is one of 360,000 people across the world who are using Solvatin to provide their families with safe water. Hi, I'm Petra from Solvatin. Thank you for wanting to learn how to help to make safe water accessible for people in the world. Here are a few ideas for you. Learn about water issues facing our world. More than two billion people around the world do not have access to clean water at home. Seek to understand why and develop empathy for people living without clean water. To get a sense of what this might be like, you can do a water walk at your school so you and your friends can empathize with women and girls around the world. And lastly, you are able to donate the Soul button at any time through our website. Together we can help to provide safe drinking water and hot water for hygiene for billions of people in the world.